Hey everybody, Hatcher here with gaming news, reviews, and tips, GNRT, and we're back in DCS World looking at VR settings, and today we're taking a look at terrain textures. Now, when you take a look in the settings folder, you'll see that we have two choices when it comes to terrain textures, low and high. So we're going to test these two uh, different parameters out side by side and see how it affects performance and also how it affects our, the visual aesthetics of the game. So let's go ahead and dive in. So we have the low settings on the left hand side and then side by side comparison we have the high settings on the right hand side and I tested this on the same multiplayer server in three different scenarios on the airfield, uh, in flight over the airfield and some forested area and then on the aircraft carrier. Now the server I was on was a multiplayer server. The frame rate was horrible for both uh, trials so there really wasn't that much of a change in my frame rate. It was just bad. Uh, for, for really both attempts. I won't be playing on that server for the next little while because the frame rate was between 15 and 20 the whole time. Um, and then as far as how the game looked visually, honestly, there wasn't that much of a difference. So first and foremost, I don't think there was much of an impact on the frame rate. Um, nothing, uh, no, no huge change in frame rate. And when you looked at the visuals of the game, again, not too much of a difference on the high settings. Things maybe look just a little bit crisper, but I don't think you would notice uh, much of a difference. So if you're really, really pushed for uh, frame rate, you might want to turn this to low, but I really don't think this has much of an impact on your performance or uh, on your experience in the game. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, subscribe or give me a like, leave a comment down on the bottom, and hopefully we'll see you in-game. Enjoy DCS World.